thing is, this all happened in a week in which America's Miss Universe contestant said her message to global terrorists was, I come from a place of hope and love and peace. So, tonight, we're going to play a little game called Palin or Prom Queen. <laughs> uh, and this is for you, Nick. I'm going to read you a are number... They not, are they not... No, this is just for you. Right, OK. I'm going to read your quotes. You have to tell me if I they come from Sarah power. Palin or a Miss Universe contestant. Right. Quote number one. We are truly the land of the great, from the rocky shores of Hawaii to the beautiful sandy beaches of Hawaii. <laughs> America is our home. Uh, Miss Universe. Yes, Miss Hawaii, 1992. Oh. Well done. Uh, quote number two. I've been to Mexico many times and I can tell you it has excellent beaches. How can you have beaches and not an ocean? Uh, what? <laughs> uh, uh, Palin. Yes, two oh. out of two. Oh. Uh, quote number three. This is the most successful debate you've done in four years. <laughs> uh, if I, I, it's going very well. <laughs> This was what the House of Commons was. <laughs> indeed, indeed. <laughs> so uh, quote number three: yeah. Poles are for strippers and cross-country skiers. Palin. Yes. Three out of four. <laughs> quote number four: uh, Some people out there in our nation don't have maps, and I believe that our I education, like such as South Africa and uh, the Iraq, everywhere, like such as. <laughs> <laughs> Miss, Miss Universe. Yes, Miss South Carolina, <laughs> 2007. <laughs> Final quote. What was, what? The, what was the vice president called, do uh, you remember, years ago? Oh. Dan Quayle. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Look at that! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the cleverest I've ever looked! <laughs> uh, <laughs> the saddest thing I've ever heard you say. <laughs> Final quote. One moment I told, I'm told I'm too edgy, then people say I'm too angry, then that I show too much passion, make your minds up. Palin. Uh, no, that was you oh, in April 2010. What was that? That was you. And what that happens is when you put the Germans and the Greeks together, you get this. Thank <laughs> you.